Like I didn't go to bed until midnight. I was up watching other people's vlogmas. I was answering comments. I was working on videos. I was doing so much y'all and now I'm tired. So it's currently, I think almost five o'clock AM. So I'm up, I've made my bed already. I'm going to go downstairs and make me some coffee. Then I'm gonna come back up here and put a little bit of makeup on my face and get myself ready for work. So I have my work bag here that's already packed. I have my little jock book. This is my YouTube book. I got it in red to give me some inspiration for vlogmas videos. So I'm gonna take that to work with me. So I can add to that, there's my purse. So y'all, I have to make sure everything is packed and like right in one area because I'll leave it if it's not. I will definitely leave it. So there's everything that I'm taking to work with me today. I do need to figure out um, what I'm going to wear to work. It might be a dress just because it's just so easy to slip on a dress and some tights and some boots and keep it moving. So I might put on a dress, but right now I'm going to make my way downstairs so I can make some coffee, okay? She need coffee. So let's get this coffee going. I'm gonna add more water to my kettle. I definitely need this coffee this morning. Definitely, y'all. So what are you guys doing for Christmas? Have y'all decided? Um, will you be gathering with your family? What are you guys gonna do? Like we have not decided yet, my family that is. We were thinking to have everyone um, take a COVID test before we decide to gather. And that's just for the sake of my parents because yeah, we wanna make sure we're 100% healthy before we are around my parents. It was so hard for Thanksgiving y'all not getting together. Like it was so weird. It was the strangest thing. I mean, we talk all the time and we did do a Zoom for Thanksgiving, but it's still not the same, y'all. It's not the same as gathering. So that was so, so weird. So hopefully um, Christmas will be different. So y'all, today after work, I definitely need to go to Dollar General or either Walmart because I have to pick up more toilet paper and paper towel because we are down to like like one roll of toilet paper and maybe two rolls of um, paper towels. So I definitely need to go today. And then I also need to go and pick up um, a gift for my coworker. She's having a baby. And we're gonna have her a baby shower at my job on tomorrow, as a matter of fact, y'all. So her baby shower is gonna be tomorrow. So, as you guys saw, and I'm sorry if this kettle is loud, y'all. It sounds like it's pretty loud, but sorry about that. But, um, y'all, if y'all watch Vlogmas Day 3, I think it's Vlogmas Day 3, I showed you guys, I took you guys with me to Walmart, and I showed y'all that I finally found these frozen keto waffles. Y'all, I had been looking for those waffles for the longest time. I had been watching videos of people just showing the waffles and doing reviews and everyone was saying that they were pretty good and I was like I have to find these waffles so y'all know I have the waffle mix and the waffle mix is let me show y'all all right so here is the waffle mix and I really don't care for the waffle mix just because like, I don't know y'all, the texture is not there for me. Like, I don't know, I just don't like the texture of this. So yeah, I mean, I still have a little left because I don't want to throw it away because I did spend my coin on it. Um, So I'm going to eventually use it, but I did pick up the frozen one. So I think I'm going to try the frozen waffles today, this morning maybe. So a 
recipe and here's what it looks like the frozen waffles and i also picked it up in chocolate chip so this is a regular this is chocolate chip and to be honest with you i really don't care for chocolate chips and my waffles i just decided to try it because something different but i think i'm going to take two of these or maybe one do i want one or two so i think i'll take two of these to work this morning to try them out and see how i like them okay so so the instruction says to put them in a toaster oven or a conventional oven but what i'm thinking to do is just stick them in my little waffle maker right here to just warm them up that's what i'm going to do and then i'll just stick them in the microwave at work to heat them up y'all so let's see let's see what they look like although i watched like a million videos on these waffles hmm, okay so here's what they look like and you get a total of six waffles and they are a pretty good size look at that y'all Ooh, i'm excited all right y'all so you can actually have two waffles that is the serving size for six net carbs so that's good okay that's really good Open. Mm, okay they feel and they smell like a regular waffle but here's what it looks like all right can y'all see that so I'm just gonna simply just place them on my little waffle maker just to heat them up a little bit. Or just to, I guess just to defrost them, I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, okay. You see y'all, I just have them on the little waffle maker just to kind of heat them up a bit and see there we go there we go and i'm just going to close that and just let them defrost i guess because they are frozen and we should see how that's going to turn out and i have the maple grove farms low calorie syrup that's sugar free i think i showed y'all this before but here's what it looks like and i'm almost done with this so i'll take that to work and so yeah y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and put these dishes away and then i'm going to make my coffee and then go upstairs and finish getting ready for work y'all so here goes my waffles and as y'all saw earlier i just placed them on the um waffle maker and just heated them up a little bit and so i should be able to just pop them in the microwave later today when i'm ready to eat them but y'all it's a texture for me like i love the way they look they look actually like real waffles and they smell so good they smell like cinnamon so i can't wait to eat these waffles they look so good y'all so i'm gonna throw on a little bit of concealer and some powder and it's going to be a wrap for your girl i need to go and see what i'm gonna wear i think i'm gonna put on a black dress but whatever i decide to put on i will let y'all see i'm gonna be heading out of here really really soon so i can get a hairstyle at work so i can get off and go run my errands and come home and do this process all over again okay so yeah that's what i'm going to do so i will holler at you guys shortly once i get dressed y'all i just had to come back on because this concealer is so freaking just it's everything y'all y'all i need to just throw all of my foundations away 
period because I don't use them and I don't have any desire to use them either because this concealer is so good y'all I'm using the Nika K concealer y'all right from the beauty supply store $2.99 Nika K is called the perfection multi-use concealer and it's super coverage y'all this stuff is so good like I don't even have the desire to put on foundation anymore I really don't because this concealer does the job for me. I just put it under my eyes, around my mouth. And that's it. And then I take my sponge. Oh, y'all. And this is the sponge that I picked up from Wet n Wild. And y'all are not going to know what I'm talking about if y'all don't follow my vlogs. But I did like a little mini haul in one of my vlogs. And I told y'all that I got this sponge for 99 cents. Y'all, I freaking love it. It's so soft. It's so big. It just covers like the entire face. It blends out like a dream. Like it takes no time for me to blend in my concealer. I love it. So that's it y'all. That is it. I don't have time to be spending trying to get ready for work. So yeah, that's good enough. I'm going to take my Stay Matte. I want to take my Stay Matte powder. And I'm going to take my Stay Matte y'all and set this concealer real quick. And then that's it. I'm going to throw on some eyeliner and then I'm going to get dressed. <laughs> And I think that I, um, and I think I'm going to wear my black dress. I'm thinking that's what's in my head. Just because I can slip it on and don't have to worry about it. So I think that's what I'm going to wear today. But yeah, y'all, that's the face right there. That's the face right there. And y'all, I think I need to, um, switch up my skincare routine because... My skin, like, is so textured. And it's not normally this textured. I think my skin may be getting used to the products that I'm using. Or maybe I just need to try something else. I'm not sure. Yeah, because I'm noticing a lot of texture in my skin, y'all. All right, y'all. So, I am dressed and ready for work. I just slipped on my black dress. And this black dress I got from Ross. I told y'all that earlier. I love this dress. Like, it's just... It's so good, y'all. It's like a sweater dress. It's really stretchy. It's comfortable. Love it, okay? And I have on some black tights and some black boots. And that's it, you guys. And then this really nice, warm, beautiful sweater. I love this sweater, y'all. I got this sweater from Dollar General, believe it or not. It has pockets, so it's everything. I'm going to try my level best not to wear this sweater to death, y'all. Because, y'all, it has pockets. And the pockets are everything. I just, I love that. Okay, y'all, so typically I do not eat this early, but I wanted to try these waffles out with you guys. So y'all, I heated up my waffles and then I have some ham on the side. So we're going to put some syrup on our waffles. And I'm just sitting at my desk, y'all. I figured, let me go ahead and just eat now because I really want to try these waffles like look at that Ooh. and again this is the syrup that I'm using right here so let's see y'all actually I'm going to put some more syrup I just flipped the um, waffle over and I'm going to put some syrup on this side Sorry y'all can't see my full face. It's the way I have my phone set up. I didn't want to pull my camera out. So let's see. Oh, let me bless my food. Amen. So, let me get a whole bunch of syrup on it. And I should have tried it without the syrup. Darn, I'm sorry y'all. I should have tried it without the syrup, but too late now. it has like a like a grainy texture it's not like it doesn't have like that fluffy texture like regular um regular pancake or waffle mix it has like a grainy taste to it but not in a bad way it tastes pretty good especially with the syrup i wish i had some whipped cream Mm-hmm. 
it almost reminds me of like the texture of wheat bread. Mm -hmm. That's what it reminds me of. But it tastes so much better than um, the um, the powder kind, the powder version that you have to mix. Mm-hmm. Mm. Not bad. Mm. I wish I had some whipped cream. Mm. That would really just like bring it out. But not bad, y'all. Not bad at all. I will continue to um to buy these waffles. And for some reason, y'all, it's giving me like um like an oatmeal taste and I haven't had oatmeal in years but it's kind of tasting like oatmeal to me <laughs> yeah, I don't know why like it's really tasting like oatmeal mm-hmm mm. okay so yeah y'all it's not bad at all I would say thumbs up <laughs> Okay. Back to work. <laughs> y'all, when I tell y'all that yesterday I was so off. So y'all know in the other clip I told y'all that we were having my co-worker's baby shower today. Y'all, the baby shower was yesterday. So I was like, oh my gosh. My co-workers and I, we did contribute to her stroller. But um, I wanted to do something else other than the stroller because we only had to put up like $15 a piece, which is really nothing. So I wanted to get her something else. And I had every intentions on going by the store yesterday after work to get her a gift for what I thought would be the baby shower today. Y'all, I'm just so off. Y'all, it's like when the holidays come around and I have a day off in the week, it just, it throws me completely off. And I'm still thrown off from Thanksgiving. <laughs> I'm still thrown off, y'all. I'm thinking, y'all, I might go by the store today because I need to get me a new primer, y'all. I'm almost out of all of my primers, y'all. And what I'm using today is this primer by Hard Candy. This is the Sheer Envy Blur Primer that looks like this. And I did a review on this primer some years ago. I love it, y'all. And I'm, like, almost done with this one. This is my second one. So I'm almost done with this one. And then I just mixed in a little bit of this e.l.f. Matte Lotion. I love this stuff, y'all. Although this is a lotion, it works great as a primer, like a mattifying primer. So I love it. And it looks like this. All right. And then here's what the Sheer Envy looks like. So I love these two together, y'all. But I'm going to go ahead and put some foundation on, get dressed, and head out. I guess I'll show y'all what I'm going to wear to work today. Something real simple. So I'll be back. All right, y'all. So I am dressed for work. When I tell y'all, I freaking love this top. Like, I scored this top from the Goodwill. Y'all, this is by far one of my favorite finds. I freaking love it so much. And I'm just wearing some regular black pants. And I'm going to throw on some boots, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, go to work, and I will holler at you guys tomorrow. <laughs>